Fans going on, they're getting a nice send off. Look at this. Leave them alone, you fucking So, if you've never been in a football crowd, this is what it's like. Welcome to another video of Walk on the Wild Side and I'm here in Blackpool and in this video I'm going to be taking you to the Bloomfield Road area. There's a massive game on today. Yeah, so I'm currently on Park Road here in sort of South Shore area of Blackpool and I'm going to be heading up here towards Bloomfield Road which is just at the top of this hill on the left hand side and I want to show you around the football ground because we've got a massive game on today. We've got Blackpool versus Preston. And it is absolutely mental around there today. So I just thought I'd take you on a walk round and we'll see what it's like, shall we? I'll show you some stuff along the way. Yeah, so this is St John Vianney's Church here on Park Road and it's quite distinctive. Massive church there. And I just think that uh, it's actually at the bottom of the hill here. And if they'd have built it on up here where it's a bit higher up, it would have it would be much more dominant in Blackpool. Anyway, let's head towards Bloomfield Road and see what it's like shall we I just wanted to quickly show you this view from Greenwood Avenue or Greenwood Hill as we call it look at that can you see the pleasure beach over there great view of the pleasure beach from here okay so we're now at the top of Bloomfield Road and there's that funny shaped house that only goes back one room there at the top and the football ground is right at the other end of Bloomfield Road actually so we've got a bit of a walk I can hear them now already. Uh, Blackpool are winning 1 0 at the moment. Will it stay like that? What's it going to be like when they kick out? Is there going to be any fights? We'll have to find out, won't we? Okay, I'm just at a junction now. This is Cunliffe Road. And I just heard a massive roar. Blackpool are 2 0 up. Whee! Yep, we're winning 2 0. And just down here, by the way, at the bottom of this street here, is raffles chippy so if you want a chip shop that's off the beaten track a normal corner chip shop in blackpool try raffles anyway let's carry on we're winning two nil okay now we're getting a bit closer this is now the bloomfield pub and i'm sure that they'll be doing a good trade in here later on if the score stays like it is blackpool are winning it's going to be rocking in there later anyway we're now about to head over the road here and uh, yeah I can hear the crowd even louder now this is where the little store is yeah so that was a little store I'll just show you a little bit of Bloomfield Road we're just opposite Donnell Road here now and you can tell that the traffic is now looking pretty mad as we come towards Central Drive up this way they block the road off the place up here it's absolutely chocker and these side streets around here are absolutely stuffed with cars parked for the game i don't know how many people are in it i would guess that there's at least ten thousand home fans and i don't know two and a half three thousand away maybe more than that i don't know i might be underestimating but if you have a look in these streets down here this one is called Shetland Road absolutely stuffed you can't find a parking space anywhere it must be a nightmare for people that live down there you know on a match day but yeah look at this backed up all the way down here and just over the road there is the Bloomfield Club look at that there the Bloomfield Club it's going to be rocking in there later there's a Whitworth chemist here that's car park's full it's a good job they shut at the weekend isn't it look at this anyway let's carry on we're nearly there now then check this out look at this here they've blocked the road up here i don't think i've seen so many police for a long time look at this they've completely blocked off bloomfield road wow no wonder the traffic's so bad. I can see four, five, six, seven, 
of these sprinters absolutely mental I'm going to take a look round now now we're not far away from the final whistle but I expect there'll be quite a bit of injury time so we could be about probably 15 minutes away from kicking out at the moment just look at this bloody hell Oh, I'm not leaving. Wow. Look at this. We've got coaches here as well. I wonder if they're for the... They must be for the away fans. Yeah. Just going past Savile Road now. This is Savile Road. Bloody mental. Look at this. I think some people are out early. Is that a road down there? Yeah, that's Henry Street, that road there. Yeah, they're getting ready to move these people out, the away supporters. Oh, look at all these vans. This is crazy. Yeah, Blackpool against Preston. It's a massive derby match and you can see what they're having to do. The police. It is mental. That's St Helia's Road. Yeah, there's some coming out. Of, oh, look at all these. Whoa. Wowzers. That is amazing. This is the Football Club Hotel here. I think the away supporters probably go in there. Wow. This is a massive operation. Awesome horses here yeah I've not seen anything like this for a long time at Bloomfield Road this must be the biggest game for a long time even bigger than the playoffs you know because we're now in the championship we got into the championship last year I was supporting Blackpool a season ticket holder all through the Premier Premiership and Preston unfortunately uh, they've never managed to get in the Premiership and it doesn't look like they'll be getting in there anytime soon. <laughs> Here's a little look back down. Yeah, massive operation. Check out all these horses here. Wow. Mental. So we're now almost at uh, Seasiders Way, which takes you past all the car parks in towards town, the main car parks. Central car park. Yeah, this is mad. There's another club just up here. It's called the Armfield Club. They're doing some some work on it. Just up there on the left hand side. That's the Armfield Club. So that's going to be rocking later as well. This is a Blackpool legend, Jimmy Armfield. This is his statue here. Lifelong player for Blackpool and also a summariser for BBC Radio. Okay, so we're now on Seaside as well, and we can see the tower. Hey, look at that, the tower. Yeah, look at this, it's stuffed around here as well. It says there on the sign, the car parts are all full. Hello. All of them. Mad. Okay, so I'm now opposite the west stand here and the main entrance to the ground is just down here and this is where all the protests were going on when the oysters were in charge. Does anyone remember the oysters at Blackpool? I've actually done a video on it but I never put it out. I never got around to editing it so I'll have to put the video out sometime. The history of Blackpool and a little walk around the ground as well but yeah, this is it now. We're around about seven minutes from the final whistle so they'll be kicking out soon, it's going to get very interesting. I wonder if there'll be any fights. Right, okay, so I'm now in Central Car Park and uh, see a good view of the tower there. This car park is absolutely stuffed. There's people parking 
at the sides. Sorry? Somebody was just asking me if I was parked up and I was moving. That's how bad it is. There's people waiting to get parked in here. It's that busy. So this is uh, the Lonsdale Road car park and that's Lonsdale Road there. Some of you might be familiar with Lonsdale Road. It's where all the buses used to come in. And this is the, uh, the little depot building here, which is all empty actually. Yeah, that used to be like the cafe and the toilets for the buses when they come into Blackpool. But now all the coaches park over here and there's more police up here. Look at this. Wow, this is mad. Look at that overflow parking at South Car Park, full. Look at that limo over there, look, big pink limo. So we're now at the northwest corner of the ground, Bloomfield Road. And yeah, it's pretty mental. Okay, so I'm now outside the north stand. This is the north stand here. And you might just be able to see over there, just above that white car there, there's a statue of Stanley Mortensen, another Blackpool legend. Anyway, I want to show you something over here, very interesting about Blackpool. This is a building site over here, and this is the site of the old Mecca. Does anyone remember the Mecca? Northern Soul, dancing, disco. The Mecca was over here. Can you see? It was over there right over there massive building and there was also a multi-story car park next to it the mecca the commonwealth snooker temping bowling all that happened in the mecca and now look at it it's a building site and it's been like this for ages because the builder the construction firm went bust on this fox hall this new fox hall development it's been like this for years I don't know if you can hear that, but the crowd is sinking like mad. We're winning 2-0 and it's not far from the end now. Only a couple of minutes to go. Yeah. We're going to hear a massive roar soon as Blackpool beat Preston in this huge derby game in the championship. Yeah. It's going to happen. That's it, the full time whistle has blown here at Bloomfield Road. I think it's 2 0. Last time I looked, I can't tell. <laughs> yeah, Blackpool win. So there you go, Blackpool win against the arch enemies, Preston. So I'm just coming back round again. I'm going to make my way back round to the other side of the ground and we'll see what it's like over there. Could be a bit mad this. Preston beat by Blackpool here today in the championship so I'm making my way around this way the other way was blocked off they blocked it off to stop the crowds mixing so I'm now heading back down seaside this way and you can see there's quite a few people coming out now Yeah, there you go. Big crowds coming out now. Yeah, it's only crowd. The road's going to get pretty as well. Yeah, you can tell the, ha the crowd are happy. 
this is coming back towards Bloomfield Road now it's uh, look at this it's getting busy again so we're back at Bloomfield Road now and the crowds are splitting up everywhere I'll just show you this building up here the Armfield Club we'll have a closer look at that it's going to be banging in here later check out these coloured houses here a council project now then someone's been on the drink look at this hey and this is the Armfield Club here it is going to be rocking in here tonight look at this the Armfield Club here on Bloomfield Road after a big win against Preston it is going to be mad anyway I'm going to head back down this way back into the crowds madness so if you've never been in a football crowd this is what it's like okay I've come down this road here because it's so crowded down there and it's really hard to get through so I'm now on this street here and check out these terraced houses here they remind me of um, the houses in Fleetwood so I'm just going to head down here and then when I get to the end I'll turn left and go back to that junction again with Bloomfield Road and we'll see what it's like shall we there are police absolutely everywhere I wonder how much it costs for this never seen so many cops in Blackpool for ages well I was hoping to get out here but I can't so it looks like I'm gonna oh they've got a drone look police have got a drone look at that this looks like the center of operations here look Blackpool Gateway Academy and the flying a drone how about that eh? anyway I'm gonna head back down here again because uh, it's gonna be the long way around isn't it I'll wait for things to calm down a bit yeah how about that a police drone first time I've seen one of those amazing I'm literally stuck where I am at the moment I cannot move unless I go down that way there oh hi Christine hi. <laughs> that's Christine Seddon she's famous yeah Christine is very famous among Blackpool supporters bit of a TV and radio personality as well okay so it's dissipated a bit now but the police are still sending people towards the right I wanted to go down that way but it's very very chock at the moment I think it's because of the away fans are trying to keep them separate so we're trying to force people to go down this road here yeah and there you go mental so there you go we've got a wall of police here on Bloomfield Road at the end of the Blackpool versus Preston game Blackpool winning 2-0 massive derby game look at this crowds are mental Kids. Oh, it's kicking off around here. Oh. Is it safe over here? Maybe, I don't know. <laughs> kicking off around here. Someone's in trouble. Come 
arms coming from behind you. <laughs> These are all the Preston fans going home. They're getting a nice send off. Look at this. <laughs> Mental. Anyway, I'm going to leave it there now, and I hope I brought you some of the atmosphere after this big game Blackpool versus Preston massive derby game Blackpool winning 2-0 woohoo anyway I hope you liked the video if you do hit the like button and also hit subscribe and tick the bell for notifications of new videos and I will see you again on the next one